Hey, how's it going guys? It's Money Manny with HTX TV coming at you, going over some cryptocurrency. I am um, checking out the markets here today, and before we get into the video, don't forget to uh, hit that red subscribe button, and also smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm. Here we go. Alright, so, yeah, so Bitcoin had a little, little bum rush going up. Um, I thought it was getting close to break uh, 40 grand um, I went ahead and purchased a little bit when it kind of settled out um, a little bit in the high 37,000 so um, definitely investing in that investing in Ethereum Ethereum good lord Ethereum is about to blow up as well so a lot of people are saying <clears throat> it could possibly hit over two grand by in a couple months um, Bitcoin it's it's holding strong at 37 right now it's uh, 37,228 so let me go and just go through the lineup and then we'll uh, I'm also going to talk about a few other altcoins as well um, so Bitcoin is at yeah it's at 37,228 dollars it's at a, a negative 1% on the it kind of chilling out a little bit but definitely surged up <clears throat> looking to go back towards 40 grand so uh, definitely make those uh, purchases um, Ethereum is at $1,636, um, it's kind of chilled out as well, um, at the end of the day, they're doing follow the leader, just like Bitcoin kind of chilled out, um, Ethereum's down, um, 1%, uh, definitely, definitely a good time to purchase some Ethereum, um, I hear some people talking about Ethereum could eventually be over <clears throat> a hundred, hundred thousand, and you gotta think about it, Eth Ethereum, it's kind of like, um, the way I like to say it in plain English, it's kind of like the app of cryptocurrencies. Everybody has to use Ethereum to go on the platform from the blockchain one way or another. I mean, I'm not super, super, you know, um, Mr. Know-it-all, but in my opinion, that's what I believe. So, and if you research it, you'll probably find it as well. Ethereum is not going anywhere. Definitely looking at investing into Ethereum. Ethereum, they're saying eventually it could take over Bitcoin, but at the end of the day, it's going to go up. Right now, it's definitely a good time to, to look into that. Um, Litecoin right now is at $148.70. That's slight downturn as well. Litecoin's another pretty good solid um, cryptocurrency. Uh, Ripple right now is it's up a little. It's up 14% um, in the green, actually. It's $0.45. Cents. Um Bitcoin Cash is at four hundred and twenty nine dollars, um, down uh, two percent. Not too bad. Um, EOS is at three dollars and seven cents, uh, plus one percent in the green. So um, yeah, looking pretty good. Um, markets look, looking pretty solid. All right, so let's take out Dogecoin. Dogecoin. They were saying um, it was looking to, you know, at a certain time. They're saying at like eight o'clock on, um, yeah, this. Thursday evening at like 8 o'clock, you know, central time, which is my time. 9 p.m. Eastern time, they're looking at stuff that's going to blow up. Um, it's still on the up and up, but um, actually, let's actually take a look. Right now, it is, it's at um, a little over 4 cents, so it is pretty close to 5. I know it hit 5 cents for like a little while. It slowly came back down. Not very much. It's, it's still... It's still um, on the up and up, and from what I'm seeing in most of the the trading platforms and charts, it's kind of like steadily keeping it. So, um, yeah, and you know, Mark Cuban has been tweeting about it. Uh, Elon Musk put out a few tweets last night. Um, you know, so definitely, um, <clears throat> yes, I know it's a meme coin, but a lot of people have put some money into it. So let's see what happens with it. Maybe. Uh, I'm thinking maybe, possibly, from my past experience with Bitcoin and, you know, all the other cryptocurrencies that have came up, what happens is at a random time, they just all of a sudden go up. Um, it's kind of like if you're a tra trading it and trying to sell it, you got to be looking at your screen or your phone, like, most of the day. So, but um, at the end of the day, it's most likely in, in a week, maybe a couple, you know, couple weeks or so all of a sudden it could it could blow up i'm thinking it could hit maybe possibly 15 25 cents you know if it goes above that even awesome because i you know i'm a holder as well so 
definitely um, looking great. So um, hit five cents. All right, so we got polka dot coin. Let's see what um, what the price is right now. Polka dots at nineteen dollars. I know it. The last couple of days, I looked at it and it it hit. It went over twenty dollars for a little bit, and then for some reason it came back down. Not that big of a deal, but polka dot is looking pretty good. It's definitely on the up and up. Um, has a lot of good features with it. I know I had a did a video a few days ago, kind of like went into the gist of it, um, how it worked and everything. You could probably definitely check that out if if you're not totally familiar with polka dot. I'm covering it because it's definitely in the top cryptocurrencies now. Um, yeah, um, other cryptocurrencies to check out here in the near future. Ripple, Ripple looks like it's you know it's kind of like it's just sitting there. It's waiting to do something. I know the recent lawsuits probably most likely have an effect on it. The SEC's wants to come down on it. Um, I know a lot of banks have used it, at least from my research, and obviously they use it, and for some reason, there's a reason why they're suing them, because they, they know it's a really great technology, so I would definitely um, definitely invest in that. I'm invested into it, so definitely check out Ripple. Um, a lot, some people are saying Ripple, this next year could possibly go above, you know, five, seven dollars. You know, we'll see how it goes, but definitely look into that. And here is some general um, blockchain news. Here it says, merging traditional finance and DeFi is critical for mass adoption. And um, that's where, I'll, once they do mass adoption, that's where lots of cryptocurrencies will basically blow up one way or another or grow regardless, you know. I'm not, I'm not necessarily sure if they're going to go to the moon, but they're definitely going to be worth more value in, in general says, if we want to achieve mainstream adoption, we must move toward an industry where DeFi can also serve legacy financial institutions. When capital markets open for the first time um, this year on January 4th, uh, the focus of the front page of the Financial Times was squarely aimed at Bitcoin with the headline, Bitcoin tops $34,000 as record-breaking rally resumes. And I actually remember years ago when people... You know, when Bitcoin was slowly going up and I think when the when it first hit twenty grand in two thousand seventeen and you know, people were like, Is this it's a, is it a scam? Is it real? And people were like, Oh, it's a scam, don't do it. You know, and, and now, you know, four years later it's it's over thirty seven grand and thriving and uh, and it's already on it's already a part of our culture, so you know, like they say, oh, in the future, but the future is here, you know, that's why I'm wearing the cyberpunk glasses, so, but, yeah, exactly, so right now, definitely pay attention to your cryptocurrencies and what's going on, so, and especially the new up-and-comers, I, I believe Ethereum, Ethereum's, man, tons of potential for Ethereum, because um, it's going to have, have to be used on plenty of platforms, so here, one last thing, it says, uh, the Bitcoin is seeing institutional buy-in on a level unsurpassed in its history is certain, but what does that mean for the wider crypto space? How do we move from institutional adoption of Bitcoin or other crypto assets to connecting traditional finance markets with the de decentralized finance and digital asset markets? If we can achieve this lofty goal, the inflows of capital resources and intention would far surpass the significant current DeFi space, thus leading to greater potential. So... Yeah, so it's definitely pay attention to your coins. There's a lot of great coins coming out. Um, definitely check out Coin Market Cap, the top 100. Uh, so that's all I got for.